so hi everyone there is a new image generation model in the town and it is ready to overtake chat gpt's image generation yes you heard it right it is of that quality and the name is flux point one context so if you have been exploring image generation in open source arena you must have heard of the name flux now they have released a new model flux point one context which is capable of editing images also as you can see on my screen in the sample example on the same image they're adding different elements not just that it is able to add text do a lot of editing in the image itself so before you jump on to the metrics and benchmarks and how it works what are the different capabilities let's try out the model in the free arena so here is a free arena given by the flux team to test out the model Let's try out the model on a few prompts. Create a movie poster. I am the best where a few movie characters are looking towards the sun. The sun is visible. It should have released a director's name, etc. So I'm trying to test the model usually on the text generation capabilities because most of the models fails on that. And not just this, the model has been released into multiple variants as you can see here, Ultra, Max, so you can try them out as well as you can see this looks decent some spelling mistakes are there there are few variants that the team has generated here this looks nice as you can see at the top the character names are coming some names at the bottom are coming this looks like a movie poster similarly this one also there are some text issues there but this is also looking good nice one i would say text is usually correct let's try out another prompt before we jump on to editing filling and expand dinosaurs and humans racing with each other on top of earth this would be interesting i would say the speed is quite fast as you can see i think within seconds it is able to generate four images for us this is quite awesome i would say but i can't see humans i think i did mention humans also in the prompt this one do make a little more sense but it's a difficult one as i mentioned still a great attempt i would say i think very nice now let's move on to the edit section whether it is able to edit images or not let's drop so this is a sample image that I have added. Add a ball between the dogs and make them black. So let's see whether it is able to do this or not. For now the model is looking quite interesting and very fast also. And the two generations that we did was quite apt. Here also let's see what it is able to add to the image that we have added quite good as you can see it is able to add a ball as well as the dogs are black also outstanding i would say let's try out another image convert this image into a photo frame and write text happy family so this is a family photo let's see what it do to it i'm quite sure it would be outputting great results because flux has been my go-to model before chat gpt image generation came in and now it looks crazingly good again this is amazing the first image has some gibberish text coming in but i think apart from that all the three are looking quite good I am quite satisfied. Now let's jump back to the blog where they mentioned some details about the model. Here you can see that they have given some examples also. The bird is now sitting in a bar and enjoying a beer. So the first image was convert, created then sitting in bar. Multiple birds watch them from behind. The two bird characters are now sitting in sofa theater. So same bird has been generated multiple times. And as you can see, character consistency is the key. I don't see a single flicker in the original image that was generated. Apart from that, they have mentioned that 
they have improved text to image capabilities create play and manipulate this is the point that you need to consider character consistency is great local editing style referencing and interactive speed as we saw speed was just amazing the flux point one context pro models so here you can see a pioneer for fast iterative image editing flux point one context max maximum performance or at high speed context dev available in private beta i think dev they would be releasing what i read in the blog also so dev would be open source for everyone max and ultra might not be this is the most interesting part there they have mentioned all the benchmarks for the model and it looks to be a monster compared to other models here you can see that character preservation or instruction editing whatever it is ahead of gpt image one high and medium both that is a chat gpt image generation so for now flux point one context can be taken as the best image generation model for editing for generation and what not everywhere the model is topping gpt image one and other models also we evaluated image to image models also including flux point one context across six benchmarks and here you can see that the models are still great here as well many benchmarks are mentioned but the crux is that most of the time they are the one coming out the best that is the flux point one context model here is another example you upload an image ask it to tilt your head towards the camera this is amazing what an editing what a time to be in content creation edit from the input change that you had me at beard to you had me at context as you can see for the text is changed now the theme is changed for at the background at points they've also mentioned that certain limitations are present but they are not that much as you can see some blurring is happening something is happening in his beard also and they have also released the playground as we showed where you can test out the models for free full technical report is also mentioned but we are not deep diving into it but just for doing a summarization Flux point one context looks to be the best image generation and editing model for that is available on Black Forest Labs Playground for now. And soon the model would be open source and mentioned in the blog. I hope you try out the model and enjoy it. Thank you so much.